beachcombers started noticing that the sand dollars began washing up over the weekend. Word has since spread and now people are showing up and collecting them by the bag full. Thousands of sand dollars. Wow, I've never seen so many sand dollars. This is yeah. crazy. Stretching down hundreds of yards along a section of beach and seaside. I grew up around here and I've never seen this many sand dollars on the beach in one spot in my entire life. A site you don't normally see. I think it's pretty cool. I've never seen anything like this. So Amy Maddock and her kids drove here from Kelso to collect some. I woke the kids up and told them to put some sweatpants on and get in the car and we came over. It's normal to find sand dollars along an Oregon beach, especially here in Seaside. And if you're lucky enough, they haven't become bird food yet. But finding this many in the same spot isn't a normal occurrence. Tiffany Booth is the assistant manager at the Seaside Aquarium. We've got a huge uh, sand dollar population. This is a great beach to find sand dollars, especially now. Um, so they do wash in from time to time. This quantity is a tiny but unusual. Sand dollars are a type of a sea urchin. And in the Pacific Northwest, there's only one kind, the Pacific sand dollar. So the white ones have been out on the beach longer. The sun actually bleaches them out. Um, and so they still, the white ones we have here right now, you'll still notice they're fuzzy. They haven't been dead long enough to lose that fuzz. Booth is a little perplexed on what caused so many to wash ashore. And with this many on the beach, there's like 1,100. Taking away more than a bag full barely leaves a dent. In Seaside, Devin Haskins, KGW News.